apartment homes destroyed by a fast-moving fire, leaving many without a home tonight. Good evening. I'm Jennifer Lee. And I'm Paul Mueller. Thank you for joining us tonight. Luckily, everyone inside able to get out alive, thanks in large part to the heroic actions of fellow residents. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson has that story tonight. He's live at the Knollwood Manor Apartments. Jeff. Yeah, good evening, Paul. You can see behind me an enclosed patio structure. That's where Tampa Fire Rescue believes this fire started because of an electrical problem and because of the incredible damage that was caused by that fire. Tonight, a number of people are looking for new homes. At 5 a.m., even before the sun came up, fire raged through the Knollwood Manor Apartments on Rockaway Court. Israel Gonzalez heard a frantic knock at his front door. He knocked and he started uh, getting fire. Gonzalez and other family members quickly got out of their apartment. It was, uh, it was something that we never experienced before. Several people who live in the apartment shot video of the fire with their cell phones. Tampa Fire Rescue tells us the fire started in an enclosed patio and then quickly spread up and through the attic. Because of the age of the building, firewalls are not required in the attic and neither are sprinklers. As a result, the fire spread throughout the building. Unfortunately, something like this affects, affects a lot of families. Code enforcement officers helped the Gonzalez family recover a few things from their home. So what have you lost? Uh, just material things, honestly. It's just material things that you can replace. Like clothing's got burned, bed, mattresses, furniture. It's everything you can replace. So, What do you do now? Now we start from zero. No firefighters or anyone who lives in the building was injured. Tampa Fire Rescue believes it's because of the actions of the quick thinking neighbor who started knocking on doors to alert others. That's a heroic act because I understand the tendency to want to make sure you save yourself, but when you take that extra step to make sure that everybody else, your friends, your neighbors are out of there, well, that, that's something else. Yeah, thankfully that person was alert and willing to help others. I'm looking through the windows tonight. There's no roof, there's no ceiling. There's a lot of damage across the top of this building. So tonight, the Red Cross is helping the people who live here find temporary housing, Paul. A devastating scene there. All right, Jeff Patterson live in Tampa tonight. Jeff, thank you.